Hi, my name is Sarah Gibson and I'm really excited to present my 2020 SSI fellowship application. Let me start with a little bit about myself. When I'm not rocking out on stage at festivals, I'm a research data scientist at the Alan Turing Institute. The Turing is the UK's National Institute for Data Science and AI. My role involves applying new data science techniques to real world problems and turning these tools into software for others to use. I'm very proud to be part of Project Binder team that runs mybinder.org. We help people share thousands of Jupyter notebooks every day. I share my experience of Binder through outreach and improve the Binder experience through development. Normally, I collaborate remotely with this team, but we were lucky enough to work together in person in Oslo a couple of months ago. I'm also part of the core development team that launched the Turing Way. This is a handbook for reproducible data science, and we collate together software tooling and best practices that make this too easy not to do. I contribute to the handbook and events so that I can share my knowledge and support other institutions in offering similar services. Through the SSI Fellowship, I want to share my binder experience and grow the community to a thriving ecosystem of computation and research with notebooks. Specifically, I'd like to find new contributors with different skill sets so we can diversify binders capabilities and new maintainers so that we can increase binders bus factor and longevity as a project. I'd like to achieve this through running a workshop on contributing to binder and attending events in different communities. If you're not familiar with the bus factor for software engineering, it's a tongue-in-cheek measure of how resilient a project is to a community member no longer being able to contribute, almost as if they'd been hit by a bus. So what's this Binder project I'm so excited about? MyBinder.org is a free-to-use website that allows a code repository to be run in the cloud and easily shared via a single clickable link. Three ingredients are needed for Binder, which are code or notebooks in one of many supported languages that are published in a public repository and are accompanied by documented software dependencies. This allows mybinder.org to serve the notebooks to anyone over the cloud. Binder Hub is the computational infrastructure that powers mybinder.org and orchestrates a range of technologies, including Jupyter Hub and Kubernetes. This is an open source project that is free for anyone to deploy in their own institutions. When I first began working with Binder Hub, I found the number of interacting technologies involved overwhelming. So during the Turing Way book dashes, I sat down with a live illustrator to create this image of a Binder Hub ecosystem to help clarify and visualize how these tools work together. I'd like to use the network the fellowship will provide me with to connect with new communities and find different pathways to lower the barrier to working with Binder Hub. My Binder.org is a federated project, meaning that it's not hosted by a single team. The original hub is hosted on Google Cloud in the US and a second hub is hosted on OVH in Europe. As well as maintaining the Google cluster, I've also won a proposal for $10,000 to host a third hub at the Turing on Azure. Not only will this strengthen mybinder.org as a project, but it strengthens the Turing's reputation as an investor in open source projects and a leader in reproducible data science. So how have I contributed to Binder so far? Through the Turing way, I developed and ran successful workshops that helped make binders out of their own projects and deploy binder hubs. My work with Binder Hub on Azure meant I was able to develop a one-click button that reduces the complexity of the deployment process. And at this year's RSE conference, I was invited to speak about collaborating with the Binder team on the RSE Worldwide panel, as well as running my Zero to Binder Hub workshop. I absolutely love being a member of the Binder community, but nothing can be perfect and we face our own issues. Binder is part of the Jupyter ecosystem, which stands for Julia, Python and R. Despite this, the development team are very Python-centric. So two thirds of our name supported community are not well represented among the team. This makes it tricky to help users with those languages or develop Binder into that space. The team is also quite small with few people knowing how to maintain the project, which can slow down development. This is the impact that a small bus factor can have on a project. The benefits a person will receive by joining the Binder community are having a voice in shaping the roadmap of the project and helping improve support for their own language or domain. And I also hope to share the experience that I get from this community, which is working with wonderful, supportive people. Through the SSI Fellowship, I'd like to host a Binder Do-a-thon. This would be a single day workshop split into two sessions. The morning session would be a train the trainer style curriculum on integrating Binder with existing teaching materials. Then in the afternoon, I'd invite attendees to make a small contribution back to Binder around barriers they experienced or foresee. I'd like to make use of my connections in the Turing Way community and the Turing Institute to help fund and advertise this event. I'm calling this event a do-a-thon since it encourages contributions of all types, such as code, documentation, design, and training. I've also identified three conferences I would like to attend as a binder advocate. 
the fellowship should cover the cost of at least a couple of them. These are the European R Users Meeting to reach the R community, JuliaCon to reach the Julia community, and EuroSciPy to reach scientific users. My aims for these conferences would be to run hands-on workshops using Binder with Python, R, and Julia, using sprint sessions to facilitate first contributions to Binder in the spirit of the Turing Way book dashes and collaboration cafes, and listen and empower these communities to report or contribute their hopes and dreams for Binder. Thank you for listening to my presentation. I'm really excited to be part of the SSI community. If you'd like to see more from me, please check out my GitHub and Twitter profiles, and I hope I've inspired you to support mybinder.org.